all right guys so welcome back to a brand new video today we're gonna be checking out the, the new orb which is light yagami's orb the death orb now pretty much this right here gives 500 percent more damage to light yagami which will definitely boost his damage to ridiculous amounts but the question is is this guy truly back in meta so today we're gonna check it out in infinite mode of course on extreme we're going extreme mode guys we're gonna see how far i can survive on extreme mode uh using light yakami with this team setup okay so i'm gonna be entering the uh chicken map i'm gonna enter that one because this is one of my favorite maps right now because of just like how everything's like so cramped up and i feel like it'll be perfect for light yakami so let's go inside and of course i removed mihawk from the team and i put god goku instead so uh yeah let's get it all right guys so pretty much what i'm gonna be doing is i'm gonna be setting up my gokus over here and after i set up some gokus after i place down like three i guess i'm gonna have my escanor set up right here like last time on my other video if you guys watched that and of course blackbeard's in the front right here and of course light yagami's will be set up right here i think because light yagami he has 120 range, right? But if I buff him with Merlin, he'll go up to like 162. And with that, he'll pretty much fill up the whole entire map. So that's why I picked this map because it's going to be perfect for this guy. Now, as I'm playing, placing down my Escanors, my main focus is to try to get like, I don't know, like one, no, 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 at least like two Goku's maxed out and then max out all my light Yagami's because the thing is with this setup is like Goku's super expensive and uh light yakami is super expensive so i'm gonna try to max out my light yakamis first before i max out all my gokus just to make sure i got all my light yakamis i really wonder how much damage i'm gonna go up to with light yakamis once i reached like near the rounds where like i'm really about to lose probably i could see like because i got like 300 million damage right without having like anything like that so what if if i use light yakami because with Light Yagami, I mean, the damage is going to go even higher. It's going to go crazy. So I could probably see around like maybe a billion damage. Hopefully, if that actually happens, that would be crazy. But our main focus is not really damage farming, guys. The main focus of this video is just trying to see how far I can go with God Goku and Light Yagami working together. But mainly, it's just trying to see how Light Yagami is. All right, you guys. So pretty much I have one Escanor maxed out. And with that one Escanor maxed out, basically I'm placing down my Blackbeard right here. Placing him on last as well. And once I get that 500 that I'm missing, I'm just going to get that slowness effect ASAP. Because I'm pretty much getting bombarded. And I have 200 HP left on my base. I am dying right now. It's not good. I just need one more, bro. Literally one more. Okay, there you go. I got it. Okay, slowness effect is in place. Perfect. Now it's actually time for me to start placing down some more Goku, some more Escanors and all that. So I could actually survive because right now everything's really getting past me. I think I might actually place on a Merlin just so that he does his like, uh, his like freezing or whatever. But I don't know which place would be a good place to actually place him down because I still need to set stuff up. Because I am going to place down my Light Yagami's over here. So if I just place my Merlin's like right here, but I have to place on all four. Okay, whatever. I'll do that later. All right, you guys, so pretty much, I mean, I got almost all my Escanors now maxed out. I'm just missing two more, and I got it, which I will in the next round. And then I'm going to delete these Gokus from here. I really don't need them no more. All right, let me go ahead and upgrade real quick. I got the last two. All right, fully upgrade. There we go. Okay, I got it. All right, let's go. Okay, so now that that's all out the way, it's time to actually place down all the Gokus. Actually, I'm not going to max them all out, though. I'm just going to place them down so that they're dealing their damage. There you go. That's pretty much all late. And I got it. And I guess I'll start bringing the first one to max. So let's go ahead and do that. There you go. That's good. All right. So let me go ahead and place down one light Yagami real quick. Just to see. I think I think placing them over here would be perfect. Yeah, right here. So one light Yagami, guys. When you first place them down, right? 20k. He costs 20k. He already deals 107,000 damage. Just when you first place them down. That's basically... Uh, right that right there is basically him going like maxed out with erwin buffs back in the day because back in the day when you fully erwin buffed light yagami you would go up to like 106k damage and this guy's base damage is now basically as much as how he had it when he was erwin buffed back in the day so that's pretty insane and if i were to upgrade him real quick now he's at 214k damage 
this guy is crazy, guys. His range A is pretty good, especially when you buff him with Merlin, and now his damage is just crazy. And when you buff him with Erwin, guys, oh my god, I can't wait to see the damage, but we're not there yet. I still need to work on these Gokus. I guess I might just go ahead and upgrade all my Gokus to 5th uh, stage, and then I'll just uh, focus on upgrading 1 or 2 to max, and then I'll focus on placing down the Light Yagamis, like I said. So yeah, that's what I'm going to do. Alright, so pretty much just going to upgrade this Goku right here to his 5th stage. And I pretty much got all of them to 5th stage. Oh, this is on like... Okay, this is way higher than 5th stage. Alright, whatever. Okay, so I got a bunch of Gokus at a decent level now, I guess. Or defense, decent stage. Now I'm going to go ahead and place down the Light Yagamis. Actually, this guy can use an upgrade first. And then I'll do that. So, wave 30 by wave... 40 will I have enough to place in all the light Yagamis that I don't know so I guess I'll just start doing that now instead that's enough all right so uh actually I have to place down one more black beer just to make sure right there there you go and I'm gonna put them on last I'm also gonna have to place down Irwin's too so yeah let me do all these real quick because I need to get all these out of the way first before I place down the light Yagamis there you go place down the other two right over here there you go so that now, if I buff them, they'll be able to handle it just a bit longer. There you go. Wait a few seconds and then buff this one again. Alright, there you go. Buffed it. Alright, good. Alright, let's start placing down some light Yagamis. So, I guess I'll have them like this. One, two, three, four. In two rows, I guess. Placing down my Merlins now as well. There you go. So, pretty much, I have everything set up now. Just gonna place one more. Uh, oh, got a buff. Got a buff. Don't forget. Did I buff in time? Hopefully I buffed in time. No, I didn't buff in time because this thing is back. Dang, I didn't buff in time. Okay, I got to redo it again. Oh, here we go. This is where I buffed. There you go. Buffed it. Now it should be good. Let me get the range buff on there too. Okay, so Light Yagami is chilling at 162 range and he has 400k damage with just one Erwin buff. So this guy is definitely going to be going around 600k. I can see it happen already. Yeah, it's at 644,000 damage, guys. This is the new Light Yagami. 644,000. It's pretty insane, guys. That is actually pretty insane. Alright, so I also need to place down more Blackbeards. I do have two down, but I need to place down more because of those speed demons that like to pass the Blackbeards as well. So here, let me place one down as like right here. This will be a good spot, I guess. Put them on last. Uh, guess I'll go for the last W too. Okay, there you go. Three Blackbeards like that set up. I guess they'll do fine for now. Let me go ahead and buff just in case. Alright, there you go. I did it in time. And is this one actually maxed out? Okay, it is. Alright, good. I could place one down but not max it or max upgrade or whatever. So, I gotta wait for the next round. It's wave 35 and I already got uh, pretty much four light Yagamis down. So, that's good. I'm definitely gonna make it by wave 40. Especially the, since the fact that I'm buffing these Gokus as well. And the enemies have the slowness effect on them. Alright, you guys. I'm at wave 41 right now. And pretty much, like, I got this much Light Yagami's down. Of course, all of them are maxed out. I could place another one and max it out, too. So, pretty much, like, two more rounds, and I got all my Light Yagami's down. And then I'll be set. And I'm also doing the range buffs, too. I'm pretty happy with the results, how Light Yagami is, guys. I'm not gonna lie. Hopefully, it'll be good in the later rounds, too, when there's a bunch of enemies and I start using Light Yagami. wonder how much damage I'm gonna get. Because everything's going to get super crazy soon. Like, super duper crazy. At wave 51, like, extreme mode just gets so crazy that the units have 2.7 million HP, guys. It's... I wonder if in the future when All-Star comes out with some updates, like, for a few more months. If we're going to have units that have, like, 400k damage. I swear it's going to happen. Unless All-Star actually starts balancing their updates now. Alright, I'm placing down one more Light Yagami. I just need the money now, upgrade it, and then I'm set. I'll work on upgrading more of these Gokus though, because Gokus are my main DPS right now, literally. So let's see how it goes. Alright, let me max upgrade it. There you go. Okay, all, all of these Light Yagamis are maxed out, which is good. Now I can focus on the Gokus. Let me see. Yeah, all of them are maxed out. Just making sure, you know, I didn't pull like a sped move or something like that. Okay, and now I just wait. I just wait for enemies to come by and, uh... For me to pretty much use my light Yagami. So let's see how far I can survive. Place another Blackbeard right there just in case. Do I need to buff? No, I don't need to buff. I need to buff in range though. Okay, let me buff in range. There you go. And I need to buff in Erwin's now too. Okay, there's a bunch of speed demon 
uh, air units coming in. Okay, that dude has 400k HP. Okay. Uh, I'm gonna buff again. There you go. Uh, do I need to range buff? No, I don't. Okay, I'm gonna go ahead and use one light Yagami right now. Boom. Everything's dead. Everything got wiped out. I'm at 141 million HP, uh, damage. I used this one right here. Where did I use it? Which one did I use? I can't see which one I used. Which one was it? It was, uh, okay, this one, the top right one. Okay, just making sure I remember because I don't want to accidentally click on the wrong thing and just make myself fumble the bag. Because last time I did that, well, back in the day I did that. No no longer, though, because I barely use Light Yagami now. But now that I'm back and using Light Yagami, I wonder if it's going to happen again. Hopefully not, though. All right, let me upgrade some of these Gokus, though. There you go. Upgrade that one to max. This one right here. Can't upgrade that one to max. Do I need to rebuff? Not yet. I'm good. All right. This one, since this one's maxed out, I guess I'll be able to hold up a little longer. There you go. Yeah, 150k damage. This one has at what? Oh, shoot. Okay, that one's dead. Any of any else want to die? Wait, hold on. I got to rebuff with the range too. Get that range buff. Got that. All right. This one is 300k HP. All right. Do I need to rebuff? Yes, I do. All right. Let's rebuff real quick. Okay. Is anything getting past me? No, nothing's getting past me. I'm good. All right. I'm good. Just going to make sure I rebuff when the rebuff does happen. Okay. Okay. There's that one speed demon right there, but I got a rebuff though. Okay. There you go. I did it. Is anything getting past? No, I'm good. Okay, let's go ahead and use one now. All right, here we go. Right names. Boom. Those are... Oh, these are still alive? Bro, okay. All right, what the heck? Let me go ahead and range buff, though, because the range is gone and I need my range. There you go. Rebuff. Oh, I need to buff again with Irwin's, too. All right, there you go. So, so far, I used two light Yagamis. I'm at 217 million damage. Keep in, keep in mind, guys, the main focus is not damage farming. It's just seeing how far I could survive with light Yagamis, pretty much. And, I mean, I did use two so far out of the eight. So, that's pretty good. I'm not going to lie. And I could, you know, uh, upgrade some of these Gokus. Wait, do I need to buff? Okay, I got the buff. Don't worry, I got it. Okay, do I need to range buff too? Yes, I do. All right, range buff is up too. All right, I'm good. Okay, I got to use a light Yagami here real quick. Okay. Oh, no, the range buff is gone. Oh, no. Okay, let me range buff real quick. Okay, use right names. Did everything die? Okay, everything's dead. Okay, I used a few things right there. I used two light Yagamis, and pretty much everything's dead again. Um, I kind of... I'm not going to lie to you guys. I kind of did mess up the, uh, the buffs because of all the effects that are happening, and I couldn't see what I was buffing, and I couldn't see what was out of buffs, so I had to get rid of all these effects, guys. Uh, that was kind of... That was not good. Like, I couldn't even do anything. I couldn't rebuff or anything like that. It was not good at all. So, yeah, I, I kind of wasted one light Yagami in a way, kind of. So, I think I wasted like 200k damage. 200k damage is not that big a deal, though. So, I mean, I'm at 260 mil damage. Not bad. And, I mean, I'm at wave 50. That's really good, guys. Wave 50 is good. That's another four. Or, actually, that's actually three. There's another three ghost units right there. Whatever the things that give you the exp okay guys here we go i'm gonna go have to use light yagami right there oh my god okay i use it in, in time let me clutch it let me clutch it please let me clutch it no oh my god i did wait let me just use all of them is all of them used okay i used all of them i'm at 353 million yeah 354 million all right cool uh that's not bad well guys there you guys have it this is the video of light yagami all i can say for if you want to damage from with this character then pretty much it's gonna be super good especially in normal mode i was playing on extreme mode and my main focus wasn't really getting as much damage as i can but i did get to wave 50 though so that's pretty good yeah guys i think light yagami is definitely back in the meta 100 back in the meta for damage farming though so uh i guess in a way light yagami is back in the meta i don't know if i were to use light yagami i i, I don't know it's kind of on a weird spot for me it's like one of those type of units like it's good but there's also other units out there that are just as good, pretty much. So, yeah, Light Yagami is just a good unit now. If you don't have, you know, Meta Knight or something else, then you use Light Yagami. Because Light Yagami is good now, too. So, yeah, this character is pretty good. I recommend getting this character. Comment down below what you think about Light Yagami. And that's pretty much it for my video, guys. Thanks so much for watching. And peace out, everyone.